Thank you for checking out the Surrey Roll Overload YouTube page. For our next review, we have the Extoria Defense Shield case. As you can see, with all their other defense cases, they are drop tested to 6.6 .6 feet, which is 2 meters, to mil spec 810G, which is the military spec for drop testing onto a concrete surface. This case does exceed those standards. As you can see on the inside of this lid, just like the others, they give you a little information about the case so you can see before you buy it. But since you don't need to see because you're watching our review, we'll cover everything for you. See, it's a two-part case. You have the anodized aluminum frame and the polycarbonate bumper on the inside that gives you double the protection of your phone. As you can see, like the other defense cases, they do have a 1.5 millimeters worth of the case that does go over the front of the phone to protect your screen in case you drop it flat onto the concrete. You can also see that you have openings in the bottom for both your speakers as well as your lightning plug. Let's take a look at the case. We have it on the phone here. The version we have is the anodized aluminum. They also have iridescent, which is sort of like a rainbow color or like oil on water, the rainbow color it makes. That's what this uh, aluminum part of the case looks like. You also have red, space gray, which is the color we have here, rose gold, silver, gold, and black. So depending on what color you like, they do have one seven different color options for you to choose from. As you can see, you'll have a power button and your volume buttons, which are the same material as your case. In this case, it's the, the space gray. If you get one of the different colors, you will have a different color. The buttons are not the same color as the case itself. You'll also see it's a large opening for the ringer mute button. This one's, wait, let me see, let me make sure. Yeah, this one's a little tougher for me to get my finger in. See, it's down there. No, it's up. I think it's just, okay, yeah, it's just, I couldn't feel it moving. But I can get my finger in there pretty easily. A little tougher than the other case, but I can still get my finger in there to move it. As you can see on the bottom here, your openings for your both your speakers and the large opening for the lightning port. Back of the case has clear polycarbonate here and all of the cases this part is gray no matter what color case you order. And a large opening for your camera, microphone, and flash. Case as we showed you is two parts. Let me show you here. It is very tight case, so I will show you it is difficult. It's tough to get it on and off, which is fine because that means you're not, you don't have to worry about losing your case. Here's the anodized aluminum frame, all one piece. It's not like the other defense case that they have where it flips down. It's all one piece. It does have the defense, let's see if I can show you. Yeah, the defense logo right there. It is pretty sturdy. I can squeeze and it doesn't give real very much. And then you have the inner case, which is easier to get your phone out of. Got a little bit of dust in there, sorry. As you can see, it is nice clear, so you can still see your phone. This is the Exdoria. The Fence Shield case available at xdorialife.com for $29.99. It comes in again rose gold, iridescent, red, space gray, silver, gold, and black. Thank you for watching the Cerebral Overload YouTube channel. Please keep checking back for more reviews.